Right now, the Boeing Starliner crew, including a Tennessee native, is stuck in space. That mission to the International Space Station was supposed to last eight days. It's now been two months, and they may not come home until next year. Barry Butch Wilmore is a Tennessee Tech and UT grad, and he is on board. That's right. NASA says those astronauts, as you just mentioned, may not return to Earth until 2025. 10 News reporter Lauren Lovett spoke with an aerospace expert about the crew's potential mission extension. Lauren. Yeah, John Robin, I talked to John Smisher, the executive director of the UT Space Institute in Tullahoma. He says he's not an expert on what's happening right now with the Starliner, but he says NASA's engineers are the best in their field. Schmisher says while this has lasted longer than the crew planned, they're professionals and knew what they signed up for. He also says engineers are approaching this with an abundance of caution. Maybe things could have been solved faster, but they have to ensure safety. The reference, but they used to talk about NASA wanting uh, uh, four or six, nine reliability, meaning that everything was to go off without a hitch to the you know, point nine, 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 however nines you want to lay on lay up there. But NASA is meticulous in the things that they undertake, and I'm sure that they are. Uh, I'm sure that there are multiple backup plans and probably backup plans for the backup plans. Schmisher says the systems NASA and Boeing use are incredibly complex. Even with testing, you never know when a part will fail. NASA is deciding whether to send the crew back on the Starliner or have them join the SpaceX crew launching late next month. NASA says it will make that decision by mid-August. Robin. All right, Lauren, thank you.